that's right, we are live. Goodness gracious me, I'm back from our travels. Yep, deepest, darkest Georgia. Relax, I'm not watching Rovers in the flesh. I know, I know my record now. I think, I actually did, I was thinking about this uh, with the wife. I was thinking, have you actually ever, maybe it's not me, maybe it's the wife. Uh, I don't know if she's actually seen Rovers win in the flesh. I know we were, took her to Sunderland. Well, she did see Charlton. She did see Charlton. We beat Charlton in the FA Cup. Because uh, last time, no, at West Brom, she also, yep, yeah, no, 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 it's not me. It's definitely, well, it's definitely not the wife, anyway. Anyway, how's everybody doing? I uh, hope you had a good Christmas, hope you had a good Boxing Day, um, and all that kind of jazz. I just want to quickly, uh, yeah, yeah, so Haven, Haven, I know you just, you just ping me in the chat, I can't. Uh, I, I, I barely, I've just got my laptop back. I'll tell you all about that in a minute, because uh, we, had, we had a bit of a drama uh, getting ourselves to and from uh, England back here, and uh, I've only just got my suitcase back. Laptops flat as a flat as a doornail, uh, flat as a doornail. Anyway, uh, how is everybody doing? Let's get to the old vortex here and have a little look at the teams right here, right now. Before we jump into it, of course, I look forward to the game. So the game is about uh, three or four minutes away. Team news is in. Of course, I start with the, the, the hosts. Of course, it's the Tigers. Host to the Tigers. Ingram between the sticks. Scott Slater, Greaves. He's a player. Young Jones there. Coyle, Tyler Morton. That's right. He of course come back to bite us in the arse uh, today. City in midfield. Those two guys bossing the midfield. Uh, if, if, if you like. Delap, Tufan, Traore, and Connolly up top, of course. Then, as for the, the visitors, the Rovers, the mighty blue and white halves. Uh, we've got uh, Walsh up between the six, Pickering, Young Dom, uh, uh, the, the master in uh, in the middle of the, the field of the defence. There's Dom Hyam, James Hill, Callum Britton. Jake Garrett starts alongside Tronstad in midfield. So, no Adam Wharton, who's on the bench. Uh, we've got Sigurdsson on the left, Makade on the right, Smodic and Telelovic. Yes, I said that right, Telelovic. Uh, is, of course, up top. The bench for uh, uh, Hull City. We've got Sean McLaughlin, Greg Doherty, Sheba Dadesh, Harry Vaughan, uh, Jason Lacoulio, Matthew Jacob, Scott Twine, yes, Burley, six-fingered freaker, so Timothy, and Sirius Christie, of course. As for Rovers bench, we do have Joe Hilton, Travis, Moran, Wharton, Gilson, Leonard, Carter, Gamble, and Ennis. Now, I've been... Uh, well, I was a little bit vocal about water. Uh, 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 what's his name? Moran and uh, Ennis uh, from the games that I watched in the flesh. They were very poor. I think this is the right call uh, for them not to be starting. So we will see if uh, if that move is justified. Hello, 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 Andy in the chat. Um, so yeah, yeah, uh, drama, drama. Let me get the game on here. Make sure I'm. Uh, all queued up and ready to go. Put the chat over here. We'll put the final other scores over here. We'll put the game on over here. You're not listening to it. I'm listening to it. We're going to go big screen on that. We're going to knock this off so I don't see it. And we're laughing. <laughs> Wasn't laughing yesterday. So, of course, we were back from our travels. Left uh, uh, English soil. 3.30. Well, we left, left the house 3.30 a.m. in Lancashire to Manchester Airport, hire car, arrived, so I don't know what time, check-in was a bitch, um, got, eventually got checked in on the flight to London, I know this is boring, I apologise for the boringness, but I'm going to tell you anyway, um, uh, what you might call it, long-ass check-in for the flight from Manchester to London, uh, they told us, there's not enough room on the thing. You're going to have to put your, your, your hand luggage as check luggage. I thought, you know what? That's that's fine. That's fine. Less less struggles uh, running around the airports. Fine, fine, fine. Put them in there. Whatever. Got on the plane. Um, it was a little tight, a little squish, but you know what? Fair dues, fair dues. Um, touched down in London uh, an hour and a half before our next flight. We were making our way towards the ch terminal change. We got stopped. Say, "Oh, are you off to uh, to uh, Philly?" And they we're like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." And they were like, "Nope, nope. You, you, you're not. You didn't make it. You didn't make it on time." I was like, "What the?" So uh, us and a whole bunch of others, five or six other guys on the flight, had to go rebook. You know. Uh, meanwhile, our, uh, who knows what was going on with our bags? Long story short, uh, had to rebook our flight. Change of direction. So instead of going to Philly, we went to New Jersey. Geographically. It's not much of a pain in the butt, but it was a pain in the butt for my bags. So anyway, we hopped on the flight. It was two hours difference. Everything got more squished as we got on. Very tired, very, 
not with it, but one of my bags got lost, and then that bag it had my laptop in it, which Alex, that's why I'm not being able to set set something up for us today. And I just got, I just had to go back to the airport well, about an hour ago to pick it up. So here I am. Thanks for, for you guys that miss me. How do you know what channel the game will be on cover on TV? Never stop growing. Well, it's because I'm in the USA and I'm watching on Rovers TV, baby. I just got back from my England trip. Three games, three defeats, one goal scored. I think we uh, conceded nine, seven. So uh, that's not a bad record, is it? One goal scored, one goal scored, nine conceded. So uh, we've got to do much better than that, surely. Surely today is much better uh, and I've, I've, I've put my, um, I don't know when I'll see Rovers next in the flesh. I used to say, I'll, I'll go there for the playoffs. Right now, that is not happening. So we, are, we, will, we won't be going this year anyway for the, for the playoffs. So, because it, it looks like we're in a season of struggle. However, also having said that, we're only five points off the top six. A win here today against a, a playoff chasing side would do us no harm. Do I think we can win this today? I think I think we can. I think we can. Uh, of course, Hull aren't in the greatest of form, uh, but it is at Hull. It is at their place, and uh, they do have some goal scorers. They've got some creative players. But let's let's see if we can. Hopefully, JDT's kicked them up the arse to 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 um and 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 you know we need to win. We need to win somewhere. We need to win somewhere. I know we've got Rotherham on the horizon at Ewood, and that's something that we've also got to look at. To get us back in it. So a couple of wins, back-to-back -back wins to end and start the new year would do us great. So the game is underway according to the graphic. I'm not looking at the graphic. I'm looking at my game. So uh, I'll let you know what's going on in the other games as we get there. Make sure you subscribe. And we're underway. So Rover's going from uh, left to right. Blue-white halves. The Tigers from right to left with the Tiger Stripes. Amber, Amber and Blick, as they say in South Africa. And here we go. Talalovic, see if he can, uh, you know, he hasn't started a league game for Rovers before, so this will be his uh, debut, full debut. Will he uh, show us what he's all about? It's a decent ball on the right-hand side. Might force a corner. Let's force a throw in deep, deep into territory. Plymouth get a goal back against Southampton in the early kickoff. 2 1 it is now. The Saints, of course. Uh, Britain on the right hand side with the throw in here. Gives it to Garrett, who does also start today. You know, lays it off to Tronstad. Gets it back. Tronstad lays it back to Garrett. One of a couple of options there. What kind of a pass was that? Bit of a, a weird pass. Ziggy will keep it in. But only a bit rusty here. Our Rovers right now is flinging the ball around. Not as in their fluid best. Smonich deeper than we want to have him. Hasn't scored in a few games. But I think he's still the top goal scorer. Hey, Tom Elliott. Uh, usually I'd welcome you on. But uh, hopefully you have a good season bar today. Hopefully you have a nightmare today. Hopefully you concede seven today. And then bounce back after that. But uh, we, need, we need a result. And we need a result fast. Callum Britton now puts it out of play. Because late kickoff today will be West Brom Leeds in the Carlos Cobran Derby, former Leeds assistant coach under Bielsa. And that's later on. I'd like to see if Ken Smodic can get back to goal scoring ways here. If you are new, make sure you subscribe, smash the little bell, and also hit the like. Get the likes in. This is my first game back after a, 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 a very crazy December. Um, Callum Britton. Uh, wins Rovers, a throw in. Get going, he says. What's your, what's your score predictions? Get them in the chat here, guys. I think I did in my very hurried predictions uh, over in England. I went with a 2-0 Rovers. Ambitious. I got laughed at in the, in, the, in, the, in the comments. Somebody said we would... Rovers will not have a clean sheet. That's not a bad ball. Is he onside? Lovely. Interchange. McInday on the right-hand side. What's he got in his locker? Puts it back. Just keeping ball at the moment. Rovers flinging it around. I do think the likes of uh, Matey Boy... What's his name? Moran, Gil, uh, Ennis. Chance here, though. Chance here for Rovers on the right-hand side. 
Come on there, Mark Day. Backwards we go. Tronstadt lays it off to Britain. Can he get crossing? No, he sidesteps a tackle. Uh, and Rovers push it onwards. Dom Hyam switching over to, to Smodic on the left. Stools. It's all Rovers at the moment, but are we going to actually put a shot in? Scooped. And that was a poor ball there by Rovers. We get a lucky bounce. Gets it ball back. Arna. I was at here with this time about eight years ago and also scored a last minute goal for a 1 0. So I see. Well, you got revenge in Boxing Day when you postponed the game last year and then you uh, got a takeover and you, you, you won then and uh, kind of derailed our, well, part of our high flying season. That was a bit of a pain in the Was it last year? Well, it was a couple of years ago. A couple of years ago, actually. I actually crashed my car uh, on that day. So uh, a little bit pissed because if the game wasn't. Free kick for Rovers. If the game did go ahead, then uh, I don't think I would have crashed my car and we would still have a Pathfinder right now. So, yeah. A little bit of revenge for me, Tom. No, no disrespect. Free kick for Rovers. Uh, it's way out. Don't get excited, guys. Do not get excited. Um, yeah, Rovers are... Uh, we, need a, we need a result. Sorry, Tom. We need a result because we've been absolutely shite. Three games, and I went 4,100 miles to see one goal. Craig Ellis going three to Hull. What you doing, Craig? What you bloody doing? We're getting two-nil up against Carlisle. I'll give you goals and, 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 and drama whenever I have it from the other games. But right now, the only goals are in the championship in the, uh, the Southampton-Plymouth earlier kickoff. However, free kick for Rovers here. Scooped. Scooped over to the left. High ball. It's not, this is not a set-piece routine that uh, I would be proud of. It's actually a very poor one and eventually uh, uh, results in a breakaway here from Hull City. I've had no ball. Ooh, lovely take there by Tronstadt, who does deliver a, a telling ball, which could have been, uh, could have amounted to something, but we lose it in midfield. Garrett, surrounded by Tigers once again, and here come Hull. There's no support. Everybody's on the, on the front foot for Rovers to go forward. And chance here. It'll be a corner for fucking Hull City. What's going on here, boys? What's going on here? Swansea, manager of Swansea, have eaten Coventry City, by the way. I don't know what accent that is, but uh, they are. I've got the first goal of the uh, uh, evening kickoffs here, the, the, the regular evening kickoffs. Look, watch this guy. Watch this guy taking a legal corner. Watch. I'm watching you, brother. I'm watching you. Are you watching him, linesman? Lino? Place it short. There we go. Go on there, McAdoo. Use your pace. Use your pace. Smodic. Left. Left. What kind of ball is that? Oh, it's an ugly bouncing ball. Favours Hull City and they come on the breakaway themselves. Uh, just, just limited guys going forward. Rovers have a few back to hopefully deal with this pressure. And it's Hull now with a chance warming up for a shot, it looks like. Warming up for a shot. Spreads it to the left-hand side. Problems. Rovers on the back foot. Callum Britton. It's a dangerous ball into the box, but it's cleared by Tronstadt again. So, Swansea with the goal against Carventry. Who got it? Walsh. Walsh, who got Plymouth's goal? Plymouth got a goal through Hardy. He hasn't scored in a bit. Goal also in uh, League One. Oxford won up against Derby. Wigan tune up against Carlisle. Uh, we have Wimbledon 1. Looks like Colchester might have just about equalised here. MK Dons 1. Crawley nil. A couple of games in Italy. I didn't, didn't realise there was games in Italy. It's a delicious ball on the right-hand side. It's Hull City with a chance. Fizzes the ball in. Oh, dangerous ball. Dangerous ball. And it's cleared. Cleared for a whole, 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 whole throw in. Down the right-hand side. Come on. Oh, it's a loose ball picked up again. Talalovic. Can he actually prove us that he's actually a striker? Can he score a goal as a championship striker? We do not know. We do not know yet. He might be that dog shit. Marcus J in the house. Andy Lorraine two one uh, to Rovers. Two one to Rovers. Rovers. How does how does how does JDT say Rovers? He says it weirdly. Rovers. Rovers. I've got to, I'm got to practice my JDT accent. Rovers. Rovers, Rovers, us Rovers, Rovers. He says it heavy. Anyway, here it is on the right-hand side. Marcus Chase going with the 1-1 draw. Britain. 
Not uh, favourable ball. Comes out to Hull. And they'll clear their lines. Oh, three Maddox PC. Southampton beat Matey Boys 2-1 in the uh, in the uh, Navy Derby. Ish. Uh, Commentary of equalizer against Swansea. We'll tell you about that goal in a minute. Who scored it? There's Rovers. That's a vicious ball in there by James Hill, but it goes nowhere. Actually goes straight to a whole city man and they break. Now, chance again. Picked up loose ball. And it's Pickering, who could be joined uh, by another an ex crew. Look at Telelovich with a dancing bit of bit of magic there. Uh, so matey boy O'Reardon. Don't know his first name, can't remember. Um, on the verge of signing for Rose for half a mil. Defender, chance, broken down here. Now here goes Hull. So he will join, I believe, as soon as the window opens. That's my understanding, anyway. Uh, a lot of people are, are, are moaning and groaning about that. Um, I don't think we should be moaning and groaning about any signings. Especially his actual money signings. You know, f you know, we did we did screw up with the uh, tail we're done. That was a bad money signing. Uh, Telelovic, jury's out on that one. But a lot of other, the majority of the other signings that we've made in recent time have actually been pretty savvy. So I'm happy about that. And yeah, it, oh, lovely ball here down here for Smodic to chase. Uh, but the, the likelihood is we're going to lose James Hill, of course. He's only here on loan. Then we'll be short. So why don't we make a gamble or, 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 or a punt on a youngster who's uh, got some game time in. He's also played in Scotland a little bit. And, uh, and uh, yeah, be ready for, for next season. It's, it's probably a signing for next season, but I think we're going to get him in, in soon. And then, of course, we will see if uh, he's actually, we'll, we'll probably get some game time here. McAday on the right-hand side, hustled, hustled down in there. Oh, he tries to force a corner, but gets nothing out of it. Hull City actually break uh, with this ball. Can we tackle him? Forced out to the right. That'll be a Hull City bloody free kick. We do need Hill. He ain't going to go. I don't think he's going to go anywhere, but I think it's it's more for the next season. James Hill will go back a better player and probably will edge closer to a, a Bournemouth side who look good at the moment in the Premier League. Um, so he'll, he'll, he, he'll do, probably end up doing a Van Heck and actually will make that team. I think he's a decent enough player. Uh-oh. Problems. Problems. It's the lap. Oh, he cuts. He gets ahead of him. Scores. Fucking scores. Fucking scores. Scores. It's a tight ass angle. They score. Fucking the lap. Uh, I got all dressed up for nothing. I got all dressed up for nothing. Who is this? Dom Hyam is on toast here. G gets beat. Dom Hyam gets beat. Pickering from crew. Wallstadt through his fucking legs. Through his bloody legs. Look at the lap. He actually looked too easy. Too easy for him. Too fucking easy. Nobody actually went in. You know what? Yeah, you know, I've been thinking about this. I've been thinking about right now. If Pear Ainsley Pears was fit, he gets he gets the jersey for me right now. I think he gets the jersey. I think Wallstadt. And I, and, and I don't know how close Pears is to, to full fitness, but I'd get him in. I'd get him in for Rotherham right now. I'd get him in if he's fit. I don't think he is because he would be on the bench. But um, it, it, you know what? It, it, Hull have not had the ball. They've not had the fucking ball at all. They have one blit little sniff. One little, we can have 95% possession here, Rovers, and we're going to lose this fucking thing. We're spending it all on our on our defender, which, you know what? Come on then, Rovers. Come on then. Come on, Telelovic. Just go for it, mate. Just go for it. None of this fanning around. That's a decent ball. Oh, Telelovic hits the post. Telelovic hits the post. Don't hang around. Don't hang around. What the fuck was that? Still in play. Garrett. It's 
Talalovic with an effort could have scored there. Hits the woodwork. He's not a championship striker just yet. He needs that goal. Uh, that could have been it. That could have been the moment. Uh, we have a corner here, though. Come on, big man. Come on, big man. We have a corner here, boys. We need to respond and quick. Keep going, McAdee. McAdee again. Go on. Just, just whip it in there, mate. And again. Again, it breaks down to absolutely nothing. We are missing a good goalkeeper rather than have Dirk in goal. Yeah. At the minute, I probably fancy myself as well, and I usually I would say no to that. But um, Walsh, that has been woefully bad. Oh, this backheel bullshit. Sometimes they don't need to play the, simp the, the, the fucking twisty shit. Who else? Who else went to all these three games? You're the jinx. It's not me. It's right now. It's the same shit. Hull with possession right now. 15 minutes on the clock. Come on then. Tommy Flynn. Research with Tommy Flynn. Scooped in there. What kind of move is that? No, oh, come on. There's a, there's a lack. There's a lack of desire at the moment from some of these players. There's a lack of desire. A lot of these guys are just giving up on these half balls. They're not going. They're not running for it. Bust your lungs out. If you want to get out of this, you're, it's bad. This is badass form. Four defeats on the spin we're staring at right here, right now. Rovers again now. Possession. Where is the desire? We've got fucking no desire. Goal at Huddersfield. It's not for Huddersfield. It's for Middlesbrough. That's right. They know how to do it. Not us. Show up. Struggling team. And just roll over and get obliterated. Bukaki style. That's right. We got nailed. We got nailed by Southampton. We got nailed by... Huddersfield, we got nailed by bloody Watford. We're also getting nailed right now. Bloody hell, I'm sore all over. Absolutely pounded. Millwall beating Norwich. They can, they've managed to get a couple of wins going as well. Rovers are in dog shit, dire straits. Leicester City beating Cardiff. That's normal. Normal business over there. Chance here for Connolly to get a second goal here. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable. What a bag of shit. You know what? I might switch off. I might go stick bloody uh, Home Alone 2. Home Alone 3 on. I might stick Home Alone 5 on. Home Alone 5 on. It's better than this dog shit. Home Alone 5 is better than this dog shit. Right, he's off. He's off. The owner's off. He's like, yep, see you later, guys. I'm, yep, a piece of press. We won here. Got a free points. I'm going to go off and get myself a kebab at the German-Turkish Donner Kebab place. What a bag of shit. Dom Hyam. Dom Hyam looks, you know what? 
Dom Hyam looks, couldn't be arsed. He's got a bit of Shane Duffy about him at the moment. Bit of Shane Duffy about him at the moment. Geordie, I have no clue. I have no bloody clue. It's 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 a shambles. It's a bloody shambles. And I don't I don't know. It's it's I fear I fear that like Dom Hyam is not, cannot be asked at the moment. Cannot be bothered. Two I can kneel down. Twenty minutes well, eighteen minutes gone. It's not fun. This is terrible. Oh, miserable. Why don't you just have a pop? You know what I mean? Why don't they just have a go? Why don't Robots just have a fucking go here? they got Ingham. they got Ingham between the sticks. This could be, you know, you know what? In in another in another world, not another world, but another another club, another club. This is sackable form. This is sackable form. You know, here we go. It's, it's, it's it could be three here, boys. Not 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 a shoot like that though. But if this, let's say this is Coventry City ish, Middlesbrough, wow, well, you know, uh, Watford, Watford, Sunderland. Stoke even, you know, this is sackable form. This is sackable form, you know. I, I in all honesty, looked at these f past four games and thought we could at least get seven points. Seven points from the four games. That's what I thought. And right now you're looking at Rotherham on, uh, on, on Monday that we may get something out of that game. And I'd say at this right, right, right here, right now, in, 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 it won't, it won't happen to this. It won't happen because the Venkies don't know, don't know what's what. Took them forever to sack Mowbray. Um, took them forever to. Well, it didn't take them forever. That his contract just kind of ran out, and then we had to hire somebody else and kind of just petered out. They won't fire him, but this is fireable form, sackable form. Not saying I want him sacked, but some shit has to happen here. We need, we're in a bit of a rut. Uh, you know, I probably, I would imagine our season is over. At this, at this point, our season is over. 2-0 down, gets Hull. Uh, I'll see, uh, you know, if we can call it back to get a point, you know what, not bad. But um, right now our season is over. There's no playoffs. Well, it's not really over because we probably have to think about, you know, could it get worse? Could it get much worse? But realistically, boring season awaits. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. You should see this. You should see that. You should have seen that mess. It, hopefully, someone else has seen what I just saw. Scrambling. For, the, the goal was right there. Should have, should have scored. Should have scored. There's about eight guys. Eight bloody guys, nobody. Talilovic missed, missed the whole fucking ball, missed it. He, this was his job, his job and profession is to score a goal, and it's right there. It's like Ronnie Rosenthal style, but at least Ronnie Rosenthal hit the fucking ball. Talilovic missed it, air kicked, scrambled, disaster. We're fucking shit. That's the Rovers fans singing. We're fucking shit. We're yes, we are. We're fucking shit. We're 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 kicking. It's like air guitar. We're playing air football. We're kicking air balls. I don't even zip. Oh, he's so clumsy. It, it it is it is quite hard hard to watch. I hope he can fucking score, just to kind of get his confidence going. Because right now he is up there with the Stokes of the world. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. But anyway, should you know in a night in a in a normal world, he would get fired. JDT for a form like this, some something has to roll, and a head has to has to get chopped off somewhere along the lines. But it won't. 
it won't happen. So if this was Hull, if this was Hull, four games against the opposition that we had as well, uh, Chris Brown, you're spot on. Yeah, that kind of, that kind of, you know, I think Chris Brown has a, a little bit more about him at the moment because Telelovic is just pranning around and he's hit the post. He's had a couple of chances. I give him that. He's had a couple of chances, but we need to convert one if we're going to get anything out of this game. We've had more than one, Marcus J. We've had, he's hit the post. Oh, he's at, okay, I'll give you that. He's at, he's, he did hit the post with a shot. He should have had a second shot, but he kicked the fucking air. He kicked air. The ball was right there. He missed it. He missed the ball. Should have scored twice. Right now, we look like dog shit. And all these flicks and fucking ponies will get you nothing when you're losing 2-0. And you're getting manhandled. You're getting manhandled. The boys are getting manhandled by the Tigers. They're getting mauled. We get mauled by the Tigers. Somebody has to, uh, something has to give. Something has to give here. You know, if if it's if it's JDT, and I, I know there are people out there moaning about JDT. I don't, don't see why. Performances suck balls, but if, you know, if you go on a MasterChef and your only ingredients is a, is a loaf of bread and some water, what the heck are you expecting to make? Spaghetti bolognese. You're not gonna. You're not gonna get. You're not gonna get a, a Michelin star meal from just a loaf of bread and some water. You're gonna get bread and water. So you're awful, Blacker. Oh, well, then here we go. Here we go. It's a dangerous ball, but too close to the money. Second goal was defense. It's all dog shit, though. It's all dog shit. I don't give a shit about defensive errors. You know, that's that's uh, 11 goals conceded in four fucking games. That's 11 goals conceded. The defensive defense is wank, atrocious. Honestly. Oh, do us a favor with the back heels, please. Shoot, for fuck's sake, shoot. Shoot, Talanovic. No, you Britain, you're funny. You're fucking funny. I got all dolled up for this. Oh, fuck. I actually got out, I got out of bed. 4.30 a.m. And it's my fault. It's my fault. But I thought it was an early kickoff. But I got up early for this. And I'm on jet lag. I'm on jet lag. I'm on, I'm on air fumes. I'm on air fumes right now. When we are getting a new striker for top, I was watching online on a link. We are getting more. Chats down the right hand side, Rovers. Can we, uh, if we can get a goal back, then maybe. You just don't know, but this is not the response. I don't, you can sugarcoat this many, many ways, but four defeats, one goal scored is pretty shit. But. On, 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 on a higher note, I wasn't here for this. I wasn't at the game for this one. So, ha, ha, ha. Poor bastards, everyone else. Are you going to commentate on the game? or No, David, I'm pissed off. I'm a little bit angry. A little bit angry. Just wait. Give me a minute. We're losing two fucking nil right now. I'm not happy. Here's Pickering. No crosses. Crosses. This, and there's not much going on. It's all fanning around. It's all scrappy. When there's something to, to talk about, like, like, not right now even. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. It's my fucking... It's my fucking... Opera. It's my rodeo. I could just talk about the, sh the shit I had this morning. If I wanted to. Just give me fucking time. You turd. No disrespect. 
Uh, we're better off starting from scratch next game. I don't even know. What scratch? We haven't got fuck all to rub together at the minute. We've got bugger all. There comes Hull. Just, 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 baro just steamrolling through our, our midfield and in our defence. Sheffield Wednesday being Preston. That's good to see. That's good to see. Uh, come on, come on the Owls. Come on the Owls. Watford beating Stoke. Or Schumacher. Don't think that's a great appointment either. Don't think that's going to work out well. Um, Delap is awesome. Four thousand fucking one hundred miles. One goal I got. I got it on camera though. Check out the vlog. I think we need to keep uh, two defenders, two strikers, and stop trying to walk the ball in the net and get back to basics with passing instead of fancy tricks. Yeah, I, you know what, Andy, I, I agree with the majority of that. I don't think I think our keepers. And I don't know it sounds bonkers me saying that. I think our keepers are all right. You know, re if you were bringing in a keeper, then one has to go. Then one has to go. And we ain't going to get rid of Walsh, that. We just got, got him. It, it, it ain't happening. And I think there is a keeper in there. There's a little huddle. Players are, are getting together. I think there's like a, an injury on the pitch. Um, but on the whatever minute we're at now, what minute? The back heels do my tits in. Do you think Vickers will sack the manager? No, I don't. I don't think they'll sack the manager because they don't do that. They just don't do that. They don't have a clue who the manager is. Pierce is two weeks away, but I've always said the defence is the problem. Pierce took way too much flack. Uh, right now, I'd have, I'd have Pierce between the sticks. No no problems. No problems. Because Walshtat, I think, um, not that he's bursting with confidence, but there is no challenger. There's no challenger on that bench waiting. He can be dog shit and he'll still be the number one come Rotherham. He can let in seven here today and be at fault for every single one of them, but he will still play Rotherham. If Pears was fully fit, then maybe uh, Walsh, that will be a bit more, you know, he's got something to lose. He's got something to lose then. You know, there's nobody waiting. And that's the same with other these other players. You know, Dom Hyam, I think he's been a bit shit today. He's, he's I don't know if he's distracted. Some people saying, are we selling a defender to bring in a defender? I'm putting two. Here's Tyler Morton, again, ex-Rover, on loan last season. Went out with a bit of a, a turd stain with that shit show against Sheffield United, which cost us a spot in the FA Cup semi-final. But I won't talk about that too much, because Hull are winning, and they are pissing all over us at the moment. Now, is there a Rovers fan amongst us that thinks... You know, is there any Philly Pete's among us that think we can get something from this game? Here comes Rovers down the left-hand side. It's Pickering. We'll be joined by a crew dude. Another crew dude, sure, uh, within a couple of days, I imagine. It's Tronstad. The, the, the plaudits of Tronstad have gone away. He hasn't, uh, no one's been giving him uh, digital blowjobs because we've been losing. Uh... The thing is about that, but they're always trying to walk it in the net. They, they are. They're, they're, they're. Free kick for Hull City. Hey, it's not me this time, Raymond. Stoke have equalised. Well, sh shit in my fucking cocoa pops. Schumacher getting uh, grinding something out at Vicarage Road. The thing is, the thing is, if if by some madness, by some, I don't know, voodoo magic, and I don't, I'm not wishing this upon us because I like JDT. I think he is, I think he's a good manager. I do. However, 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 let me let me finish. Let me finish. There are a couple of managers out there that that, that are interesting. Stevie Cooper, I'll take him. Right here, right now. Do we not keep the ball? Because we're shit, Adam. Because we're dog shit. Come on, Arna. Let's go. It's a decent ball. Smart it. She score. She score this. She score. Get in. Get in. Get in. 2-1. Game back on. Game back on. 
get in. He scores. He's a championship top goal scorer. Row as a shit. We're fucking shit. We're fucking shit. But we've got a goal today. We've got one back. Sam the Smodic is 27,000th goal of the season. And he makes it 2-1. We needed this before the break. Now, there's a game on here. Ziggy with a, with a scoop ball. And uh, Stead. The uh, Stigerton of, uh, or the whatever, Smodic of uh, November would score. But he does score. Bang, 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 bang. Chip it out. Hey, fucking shit. Cooper would be would be would be my pick, you know, f you know. A, a lot of people saying he's off to Crystal Palace, whatever. But two one, that's a different story. That's a different story now. It's a different bloody story. Game on. Division top goal scorer, Smod, Smod Meister. Chance if Rovers to get a second, maybe. Okay. Uh. Chipperoo, chip, Chipperoo. Let me just get this on Twitter quick before everyone else. Come on. Where's my hashtag? Back in the business, boys. No investment, no one will get camera. Okay, so we're back in this now. Now I'm a little bit more happy. 2-1, it's it's doable. We can get something from this game. If we can, and, and hopefully, uh, Rovers will, uh, will have a fire up their arse here. So now holstered with all the possession. Rose need to get back and um, get something else. Meanwhile, uh, commentary one, blah, 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 blah. No further change. Mac and Day, the furthest man back. Uh, James Hill heads it to um, to the keeper. Come on, Leo. Come on. There is, there is, I tell you what, we, we, we can win this and still be shit because that's the Rovers way. We're not going to win this at the moment, though. Let's, let's, let's focus on, for fuck's sakes, let's focus on just getting something out of it. Next goal, monumental. Hull City get the next one. I think it's time to uh, to uh, just end 2023, will you? Just end it. However, Rovers score. Then we have a game on our hands. I'm sure everybody wants to see us have a game and not a fucking one-way uh, 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 ass-kicking com competition because I know we'd win that one. Um, oh, meat sandwich. Meat sandwich. Hull City player. Squished between Garrett and James Hill. That's something you wouldn't want to be a part of, would it? A sandwich between James Hill and Jake Garrett. Well, if it was Talilovic and James Hill, then you were, we were talking two beefy big old men. But uh, boosh. in fact, Garrett might got a piece of that himself. Anyway. Uh, yep. Sandwich. Sandwich. It was, an, it was a mistake. It was like a clash. Don't give him a card. He's got a card. James Hill gets a card. How many points have we got from losing? Don't want to look at that stat, Obi-Wan. Don't want to look at it because it doesn't feel like it's a good stat. It feels like one. One point from losing positions. I'll take a draw right now. I would take a draw. I'll take a draw. And that's not being a, still a shit Christmas period. It will stop. The, it will stop the sack talk. It will start the belief that we can start 2024 with a, with a win or a result against Rotherham. And then Cambridge. I don't know who's after that, though. I've not really looked at what's after that. But anyway, Rovers. Free kick for Hull. Uh, 3-2. Let's hope, Mad Dogs PC. Let's hope if we could score three goals. OK. 
Okay, free kick here. They got a couple of specialists, I think. I think they got a couple of specialists. It might be free two the other way. Come on, Talalovic. Uh, uh, somebody block this. Block this. Block it. Connolly on the score sheet. The lap on the score sheet. Or is it Connolly twice? I don't even know. I don't even know. Ugh. Free kick here. It's a good position. It's pretty centre. Pretty centre. Whole city with a free kick here. Number 15. Floats it. Oh. It was headed on. He had a good header on it. Two fan with the header. But Wildstack grabs it. I don't know how. And that's just a wank ass pass by Rovers. Who, who did that pass? They, I think it was Mark and Day with the pass. That was poor. That was very, very poor. I'm watching on a television boofing. I'm actually I'm watching it on Rovers TV, which is, of course, for us overseas folks. Uh, I bet you're going to say, oh, I saw you at Ewood. You're not overseas. I am. I'm fucking well am. I'm back in the, the swamp. I'm in the swamp. Georgia. And it is a fucking swamp, I tell you. It's Jurassic Park outside my gar garden right now. Jurassic fucking park. Okay, Rovers now. Back in possession. No Adam Wharton. Of course, he's on the bench. I think it's a right call. It's a handball shout there. Garrett with a, with a bit of hard work. Manhandled. Should be a free kick for Rovers. Thank you. Let's uh, see if we can come up with our own bit of magic right now. Let's have a look what's going on elsewhere around the grounds. No Premier League action today. Got to get my Premier League picks out. I don't know if I'll be able to do it. I need to get it out there, though. Anyway, uh, but being a City nil, Bristol City nil as we approach the last five or so minutes. Cardiff nil, Leicester 1, Coventry 1, Swansea 1, Huddersfield nil, Middlesbrough nil. There was a goal in that game, but it was been struck off. Ipswich nil, QPR nil, Millwall 1, Norwich nil, Preston nil, Sheffield Wednesday 1, Rotherham nil, Sunderland nil, Watford 1, Stoke 1, uh, League 1, Bristol nil, Bristol Rovers nil, Charlton nil, Burton Burton 1, Shrewsbury 0, Cheltenham 2, Reading 0, Exeter 0, Pompey 0, Fleetwood 0, Bolton 0, free kick still waiting to be taken here, Leighton Orient 0, Wickham 0, uh, Smonich on it, Garrett lingering, Garrett with his left, it'll be a corner Corner, corner. Uh, Lincoln, nil. Northampton, one. Oxford, two. Derby, nil. Wow. Uh, Peter nil. Barnsley, two. Wow. Port Vale, one. Port Blackpool, nil. Stevenage against Cambridge was postponed. Uh, and we're back to uh, some football business here. Corner. Uh, that free kick was wank. Short corner played. Tronstadt. Garrett again. Crosses. Oh, it's a decent, uh, decent delivery. McAndae takes it down as a shot. Still alive, stabbed at it. Claims for a penalty by Rovers, but uh, they were walked. They were they were thrown away. Anyone know any stream? Sorry, Woofin, I don't know. I don't know, brother. I do not know. Just put in. Um, just put it in. Put it in the on the on the thing. Rovers shot on target. Siggy, Siggy, Smodich. Oh, a bit of greediness there. Perhaps think Siggy was in a better position, but Smodich took it off him into the box, and it's uh, with Hull City now. As Rovers try to make uh, a game of it now. Can we? Can we hustle them? Callum Britton get involved. It's breaking down this uh, Rovers right. And it's not happening. Over in later to Interleague 2. Should I talk about that? Wimbledon 2, Colchester 2, Barrow 0, Accurton 0, Bradford City 0, Stockport 0, Gillingham 0, Sutton 0, Harrogate 0, Tramman 0, Mansfield 1, Doncaster 0. Here comes here comes Hull. Ooh, long range effort. Walshtat had that on toast, uh, finally. Uh, MK Dons 1, Crawley 0, Newport 0, Crew 0, Knotts County 4, Morecambe 0, Salford 0, Grimsby 1, Swindon 0, Mott Forest Screen 0, Walsall 1, Hollywood FC 1, Walshtat. Pushes it out to Dom Hyam. Oh, I tell you, I tell you, that's another. He's, he's a little bit. Like, I tell you what, he's one of these. Not not the best performer today is Dom Hyam. It's a shit ball. That who is that? Who's that? Shit pass. Shit pass. Merchant. Shit pass. Merchant. Uh, also, West Brom leads nil nil in the late kickoff in the championship. Come on then, a bit more confidence now, Rovers. Stream on. 
Chantel Atkins, welcome to the house. It's 2 1 at the moment. Uh, be a goal kick for Hull as we enter the last couple of minutes. Redding get one back against Cheltenham, looks like 2 1 over there. I tell you what though, Rovers need to get some business in though in the in the in January. We need we need uh, I saw a shout out on Twitter, Johnson Clark Harris. I'd love a bit of that action. I think he can score at this level. He's not the youngest uh, youngest player in the books, especially when you think about Gallagher. Is he staying or going? I think I, I got a feeling they're gonna do a, a, a I think he's gonna sign a new fucking contract is, is that, no, no disrespect. I think right now Gallagher, you know, starts. He's a hard-working individual. And I think there would be suitors for Gallagher out there. I just don't... Um, I just think we can... Um, uh, uh, you know, could put that money to good use elsewhere. That's what I think. But he, there would be suitors out there. I think there would be uh, uh, teams willing to take him on a free oh, in exchange for the thing. The UK. I'll tell you about the UK in a minute. But here comes Hull. It's uh, they got the players on 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 numbers. Great block. Great block. Still, Hull City Rovers look like school children. Oh, it should have been three one up there. Should have been three one up. Two fan bloody Nora. Uh, looks like Reading might even might have equalised. Two two over there. It's half time between Birmingham City and Bristol City. In the Battle of the Bees. But yeah, it was... There was a handball shout there. I'll tell you what, the Rovers look absolutely like Bambi on ice here. Bambi on fucking ice. Um, so yeah, it was good. It was good to see my folks, you know. It just makes me want to come back more, you know what I mean? Like, I, I want to... It was the first time back to the UK for five years. Uh, four minutes of stoppage time. So it was good to good to come back. It was a little bit helter skelter, a little bit crazy. Like no worries, thank you, console man, for stopping by. I appreciate it, of course, and to thank Pete. Big big shout out to Pete uh, for being able to do the ones that I can't, and that's a big ask. That's a big ask for Pete. That's a free kick for Rovers, surely. Um, and if anyone's bored and wants to go back and look at the watch alongs and see who has a better win ratio. Me or Pete, that would be absolutely fantastic. Thinking of moving back? Well, no. No, 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 no. Um, there is There are positives and negatives Negatives for um, um, for both, you know. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. Here's one small story of what happened. Nothing nothing exciting. But anyway, pre-Christmas, you know, trying to find my, my, some Christmas gifts. Went to Accrington. Uh, I think before the game, actually, before we went to um, watch Rovers uh, against Watford. Hang on a minute. Let's deal with this. Problems over the top. So we went to Accrington, had a, a weather spoons. Nice, 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 nice. Then we went to Sports Direct, right? Just as you do. I haven't been in Sports Direct forever. In Accrington. I think it's Accrington. Or Nelson or some somewhere along the lines. So I went there to buy something. In the, I was in the line. This old geezer behind me. Old old man. Little scrabby, little like a drunkard. And he said, you know, he's being polite. Behind me. He said, uh, hey, four eyes. Is there someone else Someone else on the, on the counter? Because he was small. Couldn't see nothing. But he was blatant. Straight away. Called me four eyes. Fuck's sakes. You know, I'm thinking, what the fuck? I didn't, I didn't give the guy any... Beef because I just hang on a minute. Come on, Anna. You need us to score a score. Just shoot, mate. Just shoot. No. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Get in my bloody veins. Get in. Fantabulous. I don't believe it. It's 2 2. It's the Desmond 2 2. Holy a smoke banks. I don't even know if that's in a word, but what a goal. Back in it. Two, two. Have we ever seen anything like this? I thought it was over. I thought it was over. I thought this game was over. I thought our season was over. But Pickering, bang! Smash that. Pick it out. Arna with all the fancy work. Not needed. But there's the goal. Fucking yes. Fucking yes. 
Oh, goodness me, I weed myself a little bit on that one. But it's okay, because Rovers are back. Rovers are back, Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Dun, dun, dun. Rovers are back, Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Bum, 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 bum. Da, 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 da. Blankety blank. Do, do, do. Rovers are back, Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Do, do, do. I can't spell, can't spell. Rovers are back. Oh shit, deal with it, 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 deal with it. Come on, come on, they'll have a, they'll have a bollocking, have a, Eustace, or whatever his name is. Uh, can't remember his name right now, Coach. Coach will be, what's his fucking name? Come on. Oh, well, that finally, fucking say, what's his name? I don't even know what his name is. Whatever his name is. Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Blanket. Blank. How do you spell? Blanket. T. Blank. Pick. Pickering. Banger. I can't fucking spell it. There we go. Diddle it, diddle it. There we go. What a half. What a half of football. All square. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. They're going to be pissed. What's his name? The coach. He's going to be pissed off there. Three, two, up. Love to see it. What a game. What a comeback. What a fight. Now, all we need now is the cherry on top. Telelovic final masterpiece. And then, uh, and then uh, we're back in this game. Well, we're not back in this game, but we we got more in this game. Lucky shirt, lucky hat, lucky underpants. It's two two. It's Desmond bloody two two. Oh my days! We love it. We love. We love this. That's why we love this game. That's why we love this league. Who who was talking about JDT getting fired? It wasn't me. It wasn't me. I would. I would never. I'd never put those words in my mouth. But that's a game. And, and, and maybe, much maybe, maybe I am the jinx. Maybe I am the jinx. Dirk, stay away from Ewood. Stay away from bloody England. Because right now, we're back in this. Two to the two. You've cursed us with your visit. I tell you, I'm not, I'm not there now. I'm not there now. So, as you can see, we've come back from 2-0. Now all we need is the Telelovic goal. To, of course, uh, Rovers are back. Rovers are back. Rubbers are back in the tune of Mankity Bank. I said, that's a good tweet by me. I'm happy with that tweet. Rubbers are back. 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 Another tune. Da 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 da. Da, da, da. Let me have a. I'm gonna have to play that. Play that back. Sorry. Sorry, just in love with my tweet and the goal. Anyway, uh, what else? Yeah, just so we so we're back. I'm back, as you can see. Not not a word. No, not not not. I would have gone to this if we were. I told the wife. I told the wife if we were there till New Year's Day or the second of Jan, which my parents thought we were. I don't know why. I don't know where they got that idea. We would have went to this game and we would have went to uh, watch Rotherham. So there would have been five games, and. Um, uh, yeah, she she did not. She was done. She was she was done for the first one. No, we weren't even there yet. We were on the way down from from Lancashire down to Southampton. She was like tired and 
uh, just on edge. Didn't want to go the Southampton one, and um, you know it just went better and better ever from ever from each game. Went for a Ziggy, and it's two two. Who says smoking is bad? Uh, well, Ziggy's bloody stepovers are doing my tits in. I tell you what, I'm, I'm done with the stepovers. I used to be a stepover fan, stepover stepover merchant. I used to love them. I used to love them. Uh, who was who was a really good stepover guy for Rovers? Who would do lots of tricks and shit like that? Well, that 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 was was always. Not, not not a step over merchant, but he had a little bit of flair about him. But when when Tyrese does it, Ziggy does it, even fucking Jake Garrett's doing it, back heels and tip tap tap. I'm not, I'm not right now. I don't think we're in the place to be doing that shit. Uh, yeah, Andy Barnes. Um, uh, so what's the cons and pros? Okay, good 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 question, Ray. You get it gets back on point. So you know, I we we love we love England. We love. We love the history, we love the castles, we love the churches, we love the ruins, we love the historical stuff, the little quaint villages, we love the country roads, when when I'm not driving them, you can't stand me driving them, but we love all that, we love all that, and my buddy uh, who lives down near Southampton, he lives near Drexel or some Droxford, Droxford, in near Pompey, in that area, lovely, out of the, out of the spotlight country stuff, love it. And, um, you know, we went there first weekend or so, you know, and that kind of like set the benchmark for, for our trip in England, you know, and, 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 and we would like that. If we were to have that life in England, then yes, maybe we could swap it. But but then we go up to Lancashire and, and, and spend hang out with my folks and all that. It was great seeing them. And um, but we saw the NHS, no disrespect, in uh, all its glory when my mum fell over twice uh, in, in a couple of days and. She didn't get very much, uh, you know, medical. And it sounds boring. I just hear myself talking. It sounds boring. But she didn't get much of a, a reception from from the medical staff uh, in um, uh, in the hospital, local hospital. Kind of like just, okay, we checked you. We've seen you. Yeah, you're probably going to have uh, bruised ribs and, and whatnot. You're going to be in pain for seven weeks. No medication, no pills, no nothing. See you later. Uh, we'll, you'll be in pain for seven or eight weeks. That's all she got. So we kind of saw the, that that negative, um, and also the the four eyes comment in Accrington that was also great. You know, you know, unwanted. There was no need. Did I stand on his fucking toe? Did I shit in his mouth while I was open? No, I just was in front of him in the line, and I was I was waiting patiently as I did for the next person to to be there. There was no other fucking thing. There was no need for the fucking four eyes comment. So that kind of pissed me off. Um, and then. Um, you know, the weather is, is is fine. Hey, you know what? England is England. It is rainy. People go on about it. My, the, my, my American colleagues, they go on about it. It's going to be raining in England. Yes, it was. And I loved it. I said, if it didn't rain and piss on me and, and get really, you know, and cold and bitter and, 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 and that British, you know, chill, I would be disappointed. I wanted that. I wanted... Uh, and I'm and I'm going to go on about this. Let's go big picture because it's 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 my if we were if we were doing a um a, a thesis on my visit to England. These these were my this is why my thing. I said to my sister, I said I had a bucket list. I had a bucket list list of, of meals and stuff to do. Fish and chips was one of them. So she said, okay, you're going to go to this fish and chip called Bannies, right? Whatever. Give us the directions. And we went to the Bannies. It was nice. It was good fish and chips. But what I wanted was a dirty fish and chips that you go in, it's crammed, you know, there's only there's no no room to move around. Uh, there's no seats. You go in, uh, all right, love, you know, that kind of stuff. I wanted that traditional British fish and chips. That's what I wanted. Not a fancy one where you get silver cutlery and all this kind of horse shit. Uh, no, I didn't want that. I wanted the good stuff, which we eventually found in Morecambe, you know, just a spare of the moment. Um, so that was, that was... A plus. I wanted a kebab. Again, my sister would say, go to the German Donner kebab thing. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay, that's fine. It's fine if you want a, a etiquette. I want a dirty, you know, uh, yes, brother, or you boss man. Boss man, what do you want? I want a proper kebab house where it's, you know, late night stuff. It tastes like shit. But hey, I want it, I want those experiences again. You know, those are what I remember and that's what I want. I don't want this, you know, shit polished up to be, to be, to be roses. You know, I wanted, you know, the, the traditional stuff. They do exist. They do exist. You've got to find them. You've got to work for them. They're not, of course, in the public spotlight. This Morecambe one, we just were driving uh, out of Morecambe or actually from somewhere through Morecambe. 
and I caught it out of the corner of my eye. It wasn't rush hour. It's 3 p.m. in the afternoon. Went in, fucking banging, banging fish and chip shop. Very nice. Didn't actually ask for fish. I just wanted some chips. Um, and then the dirty kebab house. We didn't get that. We got an okay kebab house. Um, so, uh, what else? What else? The shops. A lot of our, a lot of the things that I remember are gone. You know, you know, um, and they're, they're replaced by new things. Who, who, who? Don't nothing. Not there's anything wrong with it. But prawn cocktail quavers. I tell you what, some some guy got a bonus that year when they created the prawn cocktail quavers. I love. I don't like quavers because they're cheesy. I like the texture of a quaver with the prawn cocktail. I think they had barbecue quavers as well. Ooh. Also, what's with all these weird new pot noodle flavors? You know, what happened to the, uh, you know, I, I, okay, I, I bought, we bought the curry one, which is the standard, and then the Donna kebab one. Weird, 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 weird. I bet the chippy was at Millenthorpe. Dirt. I don't know. I don't know. It was in Morecambe. Um, it wasn't, it was like off the coast. Like the coast was right there, but it was down in a little alley. And uh, it was, we went there when the wind was like a tornado. It was like really bad weather. Um, did a vlog. Uh, yeah, Walkers, walk. well, actually, so Walkers used to do like, Beef and onion or steak and onion or something like that. Crisps. Gone. Uh, don't exist anymore, you know. Tried my eyes out. Where, where are they gone? Where, where have they gone? But there's a lot of new shit and there's a lot of shit that I wanted there that wasn't there anymore. And then I talk to people and they think that I've been, I've dropped, I was dropped on my head as a child. Like, you know, I ask for the, I say, hey, do you, do you have these things? I had problems try like I got hooked on Magnus again. I love Magnus the cider. Um, went to went to one supermarket. Asked the guy, "Hey, where's the Magnus?" Uh, oh, they don't do it in bottles. My ass, my ass. They don't do it in bottles. I've just fucking had two two three days running. I had a Magnus in, in a fucking bottle, and they're like, "Oh no no no, it's only in cans." Or maybe you don't stock the ones in bottles, but they do fucking sell them in bottles. I just had them. I was well sad in the 30. Thank God. Something it's, yeah, I me mean, too, Oscar. Thank heavens for that. Yeah, it's been all well windy. I live in Barrow in Furness. I want to see again. And then again, I had all these bucket load, bucket ideas, bucket list ideas to do things. But, you know, when my mum, my mum fell over day, whatever. Don't even know what it was. It was like the first fucking full day we were there, the Friday. Thursday we arrived. Friday she fell. And that changed the whole dynamic because I just thought my mum can't really walk anywhere which can walk but but just my conscious was like you know took a bit of a wobble there we went to Southampton and then I got a call on the Sunday my sister said mum's fallen again right outside the house I thought fuck this shit I thought I'll get her a cane for her Christmas she loved that um but just kind of changed the whole dynamic that I couldn't really just swan off and do what I wanted I kind of had to you know be be around tenants extra spam fritters bring back the 80s dirk Dirk, nice Christmas, Adam. Yep. Hopefully, this is a lucky shirt. Hopefully. I'll tell you what, you don't want to smell a vision right now, though. It does. I am uh, sweating my zinger off here in the jungle, in the swamp, uh, with this on. But, um, but no, hey, I loved it. Loved it. Um, you know, we, 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 it could, could have been longer. Uh, I'm already, th but the travel, the travel itself was a bitch. We had free flights to get out of here, to get over there. Next time, we're going to drive a little bit more. To, uh, to eliminate the, the travel and, and fly from Orlando to London and then just fucking drive up. Just do a straight flight next time. Fuck this little puddle jumping flight so that lose your fucking baggage. But anyway, so all in all, you will forever live... In no, 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 no. no. Um, I know that's where you were getting it at. So, it's, you know, like... You don't get a house like this in England for this price. I tell you that now. You will not get that house. Like my buddy's house in the in the country was probably the same cost as this, give or take. But they got they got they got a good good deal on the land. But the size of the house is about half. Same with my sister's house and my mum and dad's new house. It is Luna. Miss my Luna as well. Um, you know their house is about half. Uh, might, not, might not be as pricey as this house, but still, but still, you know what I mean? It was, uh, so the house, house traveling around over here for the most part is better because I, we just went to Jacksonville, you know, quite a big, big city, 
quite a, a you know quite an easy drive going from fucking Burnley to wherever just a a bit shitty a bit shitty a bit 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 tight fucking going down the roads going down the roads it's tight it's 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 you have to breathe in a few times everyone breathe in uh, so we can squeeze past these cars because it is quite a tight thing move here in Norway you know what everything is expensive yeah well everything's expect like everywhere I don't know what's cheap anymore but I am a man who does like to travel I would love to love to dabble around and, and explore explore other parts of the world like Asia and uh, Africa a bit more Africa did my Kenya bit out there that was fun uh, I, I do love the, do love all the foods the, I know I know they've got rid of a lot of good good stuff and they've got some new good stuff but snacks foods in England are much much more better I think and the, the restaurant food for me people slam British food say oh it's shit but realistically it's a lot of other cultures kind of together the fish and chips is kind of a British kind of thing people go on about Americans trying to imitate the fish and chip but they get the batter completely wrong uh, and of course the Indians one thing we did have an English Chinese. That was pretty shit. The American Chinese is much better. Okay, that's enough jibber jabber. We're back in the game. Uh, matey boy, Hull City getting their asses handed to him on a plate. 2 0 up to 2 2 at half time. Rovers, though, they probably got uh, uh, KF. Didn't get my KFC Zinger Tower Burger, but I bet the fucking Rovers boys got a KFC Zinger Tower Burger at half time because uh, rate US food to UK food. So the KFC in, in America is banging, uh, but they just need the Zinger Tower Burger to complete their menu. And that would make it... Didn't bother with the McDonald's because that's the same. Uh, I do like the pub. We did have a carvery. It was my last full meal. Rather than beating Sunderland, early goal, second half. Um, Rotherham, uh, uh, but uh, yeah, the, the pub grub is good. The, the English breakfast is amazing. Like American breakfast with the pancakes is good. It's good, but I don't know. I don't know if I was if I was starved on an island for six months, just eating coconuts or whatever. And then they said, "Okay, what breakfast do you want?" Chance here, Rovers. Ooh, can Rovers now? You be buoyed on can they uh, do they have a rocket up their ass at the back here to kind of keep a clean sheet for the second half or not we will see Luna is here she's doing uh, I, I was here American food is trash uh, again it, it's, it's, it's my scenario my dream scenario realistically would be six months here six months there the summers in Georgia fucking hot um, so winters here summers there I don't even know Rather than one up, I'd love to see it against a Michael Beale Sunderland. Don't give a shit about no Sunderland no more, unless unless Dax playing. But um, they they ousted Mowbray, so I don't give no rat's ass. I hope they hope they have a terrible season. I, ho I definitely desperately hope they fail, because I would love to see Mowbray back in the Premier League. And I think Beale is not going to do that. Beale is not going to get them fucking Premier League football. And I think they're kind of cursing their luck a little bit. If they held out, if they had held out. They would have had Stevie Cooper in there. There's a delicious ball here for Hull on the right-hand side. He's got a lot of work to do. Ooh, we went for it. Went for it again. Bolton won it up. But, you know, like American steaks. Steaks are fucking banging. And I'm sure the pizza is much better in America. I don't know. I don't eat that shit. Um, Chi American Chinese is better than British Chinese. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. However, however. Chips and curry sauce, whether it's from a Chinese or a fish and chip shop, that's top tier food right there, right, right there. West Brom one up against Leeds. Wow, that's a good one. So lots, lots. I could, lot, I could, I could talk more. I could talk about this for for hours. Anyway, let's get back to the game here, boys. What were you sad? You did get home game during. I did get a home game. I went to see Wat Watford against Rovers at Ewood. Um, and we looked decent for the first 60 minutes of that game. 
but we lost. I'm sad I didn't see a fucking Rovers victory. That's what, that's for sure. Oh, it's a delicious ball. Smodic now. As uh, Siggy leaves it, left it for him. Uh, mess. New to here, Pro Scan Imaging. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new, make sure you smash your subscribe. Yeah, Chips and Curry is, is top tier grub. So is uh, English Breakfast, top tier. Chicka tikka, chicka, we need like a British Indian. I had a couple of those. I had uh, a Balti pie at Huddersfield. Pretty good. When you're fucking freezing, it's good. We had a good, um, I had a lamb Rogan Josh. Pretty good. That was in Southampton, Droxford or wherever the fuck we were. Anyway, here comes Hull now. That goes out of play. Rovers. <laughs> Oi, you're right. My memory slow. Oh, yeah, you're right. My memory slow. Yes, yes. I, we did, we did, I did get a home game, but it was grim. Come on, Ziggy. Headed down to Smodic, who will take this one. Back to Pickering, who plays it out. Dom Hyam, Jimmy Hill. Those, those two at the back need to, need to uh, tighten it up a little bit. Pushed out to Callum Britton down the right, who will just welly it. And uh, foul. Telelovic, big man. I love me some chicken tikka masala. I tell you what, I'm hungry right now. We are having dominoes tonight because I can't be asked. We're having our, our late Christmas here tomorrow, which we're doing Chinese because I can't be asked cooking. However, then we're going to have a New Year's, uh, New Year's Eve family game night or whatever, and I will cook. I will cook that day. What's your favourite food, dinner-wise and country-wise? I prefer Indian over anything. You know, it, I'm pretty simple, really. I do like a good fucking beastie steak. A tomahawk steak with fries. And, and, and my mum's cabbage salad. With a Viennetta for pud. Or something like a, a sponge cake and custard. Come on, let's get the likes. That's right, Andy Bars. Get the likes up here. We have a red card over at Watford. Uh, they are 1-1 against Stoke at the moment. That's, of course, giving Schumacher, you know, you know, a chance to, to win another game. I can't cook. I can't cook. Uh, I, I'm forced to cook. I actually wanted to be a chef in my early days in the Air Force. I was I was looking to be a chef, but then I noticed or got told about the hours. I thought, fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. I ain't, uh, I'm not getting up at 4 a.m. and working till 11 p.m. or whatever. You can shove it. So that kind of put me off. Thank you for all the love of the chat. Uh, we, need a, we need another goal here for Rovers. Telenovic. Oh, it's a bad... Well, it's a mistake, I think, by Tronstad, who fouls, but uh, nothing. No, something comes of it. Another free kick here for Hull. Watford 1-1. One, one. Yep, indeed. They got a red card, though, in that game. Still half time between Ipswich and QPR. Not sure what went on in that game. Uh, Wigan 2 up against Carlisle. That's over. Colchester are about to concede against Wimbledon. 3-2 in that game. West Brom 1 leads nil. The goal is Dianganga. Telovich has been all right. He should have scored twice. He's probably doing himself. I think he's done much better than Ennis has. That's saying something. It's also saying another thing because Ennis has been shit uh, for a little bit. Um, Tyler Morton's hanging over this free kick. I think Sierra's also hanging over this free kick. Traore as well. Can we defend? Can we defend like warriors? Because we need to. And, and matey boy, Walsh, that you better be on your fucking tippy toes here, brother. I need you to pluck this out of the air because we cannot concede another. Smodic hits the wall. Yep. Uh, so, yeah, dominoes tonight. Dominoes. Uh, and then I'm going to have a bath. I've been waiting for a bath. I'm going to have some beers and a bath. I tell you what now, that is one of the most underrated things going. Beers and a bath. Oh, yeah. Being... Oh, yeah. I'm all about the, that. It's a delicious ball. Oh, it's a delicious ball in there by Hull, but it's cleared by Rovers. It's a bit of a weird 
uh, passage of play right now. It's all Hull. They're fizzing it in there. It's cleared again. Telelovic, furthest man forward. It'll be a free kick for us. Hi, oh, do you remember Great Howard Rovers FC? Of course we do, with that name like that. And so that's a name that doesn't go uh, un un unrecognised. But yes, beer in a bath. That's what I'm not 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 beer in the bath. I'm going to be drinking a couple of beers in the bath. But Domino's. So basically, uh, I've also got to wrap our gifts. Fucking hell, I'm not uh, like I'm going to be doing that after this. I think. Well, there and order the pizza. It's a loose ball, Rovers. We could do with a goal here, boys. Imagine, imagine if we were if we were to somehow win this game. Imagine, imagine the bedlam. Hope I don't even know. I, I should really check in with the with the troops. Alexander Haben, if you're watching, ask the because I don't know about my WhatsApp. Ask the WhatsApp people if anybody's doing a vlog. If anybody's at this game, I didn't hear from Jacob, so he might be there. He might be at the game. Let me fuck it. I'll do it. I'll fucking do it. I'll do it. Let me, uh... Um, but yeah, it was good. It was good. To, uh, I saw, I met up with Jacob, met up with, uh, met up with Millie, met up with, uh, met up with Lewis. Lewis was by chance. He was sat right next to us. In the game against uh, Watford, of course, Millie and, and Jacob, we, we had a couple of beers, um, which was nice. Uh, Alexander and Haben, I tried. I fucking well tried. Here comes Garrett on the right-hand side. A couple of step-overs. Fizzed in there. Smodich turns and shoots. Alexander Haben's listening. I tried. I tried to meet Haben, but um, he was out. He was out on the town. He was out pulling all the ladies, and I fucking missed him. It's a decent effort here. Second half. Corner for Rovers. I went to his house, but he wasn't there. Come on then. Come on, Atolovic. All we need is... It's actually Dom Hyam. The two captains colliding. Two fan and Hyam there. But he got his, uh, got his little welcome pack. So uh, his little um, thank you thing. And hopefully, hopefully you've eaten it. And hopefully you've you've enjoyed the Twinkie, and hopefully you enjoyed all the other American candy I threw at you. Leicester two 0 up there, Coventry one one, Borough one 0 up against Huddersfield at long last. Sheffield Wednesday still beating Preston and Rotherham beating Sunderland. Big days so far for the teams that are struggling, except for Huddersfield. Two fans not captain. Oh, I thought he was the captain. Come on, Talalovic, we need you. We need you to score. Get that confidence up. Get that confidence up. Yeah, I went to Skipton. Um, didn't realise until it was too late that we'd already been there before. Um, I thought, you know what, let's go check out this castle. And then we were they were there. It was good. Enjoyed it. Uh, it, was, it was late. It was late in the day. Went to Lancaster as well. However, save myself some money because the tour was like an hour or so later. I was like, "Fuck that! I ain't got the time. I ain't got the time for that." Uh, yeah, Skipton. It was. It was. It was cool. Went to Boundary Mills. I don't know if that's closer to Skipton. Uh, the retail shop thing, not the best. A little bit disappointed with that. I'm going to Romania this summer for one week, first time traveling solo. Wow, wow, we will go. To, go make sure you go to Transylvania. Lovely ball, Siggy. Actually, bad take by him, but uh, he's trying to fight for it. Her hull have the better of it at the moment. I'm jealous, Ray. I I'll be all about that. Oh, it's a slip. It's a slip by fucking Callum Britton. JRC needs to get himself back as well. Ooh, drills across the face of goal. No one's over. It's just today, did a medical emergency in the crowd. Huddersfield have equalised. Get in there, bloody Terriers. Get in there. Come on, get a result. Um, but yeah, I'm jealous, Ray. That's, that, 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 I, I, please, can you give me a shout out? Great Arbor Rovers FC, welcome back to the show. Hopefully, Rovers will score a third just for you. I have no say in it if that's ever going to happen, but if it is, it's all you. Barsley, 3 2 up. Who are they playing? Who are they fucking playing? They're playing a big team. 
Ooh, are they 3-2 up? I see 2-2 at the moment in that game. They were 2 up in that game. But let's see if they can pull it back like Huddersfield pulled it back. Like we've pulled it back. Uh, but right now, we need a hat. We need to dig a little bit deeper. Oh, come on. What the fuck's that in the middle of the field? It's, it's a milkshake. Is that a milkshake? Oh, my milkshake. My milkshake brings all the blood. Da, da, da. There's a milkshake in the middle of the MKM Stadium. Is that a milkshake? I don't know. It looks like a fucking milkshake. I am blind, though. My milkshake is in the middle of the MKM Stadium. Come on, Dom Hyam. Nothing in particular. Something vegetarian, obviously, but I'm not picky except for olives. Gotcha. Loose ball. Bad ball by, uh, by Hull. Got the fans groaning. They will not be happy if this goes uh, completely the other way. 4-2, Barnsley. Are you taking a piss? Oh, you are taking a piss. You're in dreamland, Christopher. You're in bloody greenland. I said we're going to finish 3-2. I hope you're right. But right now, it's a little bit ropey from Rovers. Kind of Britain. Free kick for Rovers. What we got in our locker? To, uh, uh, Tronstad plays out short to the left-hand side. To Pickering, who's got his, uh, another collector's item. We're going to be coming in fairly late. Okay. Just planning my uh, Christmas shenanigans. What's with all these crowd emotions? One dying heart attack in Bilbao. A couple of... I don't know. I don't know. It's it's, And that's why they're going on about these defibrillators. Like like how it's become a necessity. You know, not just for the players, but for the for the for the for the fans, because thing. You know what? I actually left the game against Huddersfield early, like six or seven minutes early, because it was that shit. And I've never, I've never thought I was Talanovic. He had a good, good bit of play. Yeah, he's he's been all right. Better than better than Ennis. That's that's how I'm that's how I'm gonna say that. When whoever asks, how was Talanovic better than Niall Ennis? Niall Ennis looks Shit. Uh-oh. 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 Down the throat. Down the throat of Walstadt, who hopefully has taken his Weetabix or, has, or, or had a couple of bananas. Because when Leo Walstadt has a banana, he turns into something else. He turns into the flying Swede. Because he's a fucking Swedish banana man. Uh, back to Dom Hyam again being pushed back a little bit by Hull it's a wild pass it's a terrible pass it's a fucking terrible pass come on then deal with this guys a lot of tricks and ponies Scott White on the bell goes over goodness gracious me so yeah they've got some deadly players on the bench have to have uh, Hull City we are look what would we do what would, what would our likelihood be Nah, Ennis could come on can shut me right up because um, Leonard, he can score goals, maybe. But uh, we got Travis. Are we are we a better team with Travis on? Chinese food isn't that good. Um, there we go, McAday. McAday, it's a fucking foul. How was that not a foul? I don't believe it. Two fans in the area, boys. Corner. What has a he hit the post? Lewis BIFC, and he also had a, a an air shot. He had an air shot that he uh, was in the right pos position to do so. He's also been a little bit more involved than Niall Ennis has done in his time. Tyler Morton coming in here. Pick him a nose. Watch these big boys. Watch these big boys. Great fucking... That's why Leo Walsh is number one. That is why Leo Walsh... I might have to, I might have to put that one online. That's why he's number one. Wow. But not there yet. Not there yet. Just defend like warriors. Commentary 2 went up against Swansea. They've come back from a goal down. Are you taking the piss? Fuck off. I ain't putting that online. You can shove it up your ass. Fucking shove it up your ass.
We are so bad. We are so so bad. Things were going so good. Who is it's I think Callum Britton. Callum Britton make a right mess here. Uh Wow Stat. And James Hill. James Hill and Callum fucking Britton. Come on then, Rovers. I can't remember how we got our goals. Uh. Domheim taking this too fucking long. Come on. What's up with Britain? He's usually... I don't know. Well, he might be decent as a uh, forward player, but... As, as a um, defending right back or whatever, fucking, he's been mad. He's been he's been sloppy. He's been fucking sloppy. Uh, Huddersfield may have got a goal. No, they don't. It's not happening. I was going to say though, I did have a. Uh, I was going to put that bit that uh, save up there. Who would we take off right now? Who's been... Who's been... I would probably take Callum Britton off. I'd take fucking Callum Britton off. Travis on. He could play it right back. Or go for a back three. Uh, yeah, I know, Ray, but that's... that's that's. Leeds losing the West Brom... Get Hyam off. Come on then, Rovers. Let's go. Smart itch. Come on then, Ziggy, do something. Do fucking something, buddy. Not just fucking tricks and ponies. Go on, shoot, mate. Shoot the big, big gangly German. I could say that because I'm fucking... Oh, fuck off with your offside flag. Bristol Rovers being Charlton. Don't really give a shit now. Everything's gone. I'm rather than winning. Sheffield Wednesday winning. All them teens at the bottom getting close. Here comes Niall Ennis. Moran. Wharton. The three players who are shite. Uh, well, Wharton, a little bit shit. Well, yes, he's the only one who scored for us. Bar the two goals today. Don't we? Don't we all, Alex? So Talalic will not get his fucking goal. McAday off, Garrett off. I really don't think, I really don't think there's much in this. Like, it's only one goal in it. I would still take a point. I would still take a point if we can get a point out of this. I would. 23 minutes to go. Oh, no, no, it's prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. Because right now I. I'm not a believer in you. How was that a fucking foul, referee? There we go. If they get fourth, it's fucking over. It's over. That's a f Is that a foul? Is that Look at the linesman. Is he not doing anything?
Hull City snapping at our heels again. Instead of a Zamba, we're getting an old Reardon. We're getting an old Reardon. Oh, dear, dear, dear. What else? Anything else? Birmingham still 0 0 with Bristol City. Cardiff losing against Leicester. Coventry 2 1 up against Swansea. Huddersfield 1 Middlesbrough 1. Ipswich 0 QBR 0. Millwall 1 Norwich 0. Preston 0 Sheffield Wednesday 1. Rotherham 1 Sunderland 0. Watford 1. Stoke 1. Not really anything crazy. This is the crazy game. Duke, I want you and Alex to do a Rovers live stream at some point. Uh, we do. I do. I want that too. We can, we, can, we can work on that. We can work on that. Come on, Tronstat. We need to go. Come on. Come on, please. Niall Ennis. Niall Ennis. Oh, come on, Niall Ennis. See, so fucking, so fucking slow. So fucking slow. It's, it's, it's like distracted all the time. Sunderland equalised against Rotherham, 1-1 on that game. We have a free kick here, Adam Wharton. We'll take it, but it's a little bit out. It's quite a long way out. Don't get your hopes up. Corner? Another as a chance here for Rover set piece. The Thunder clawing it uh, and equalise against Rotherham. <laughs> injured. Who's injured? Smolich. Yeah, Dolan is injured. You're right. Adam Wharton will take this corner. Bit of melee in the box. Come on, somebody be a hero. Somebody be a hero because we are dire straits. We need a result. And right now we're not getting it. Wharton, mess, cleared, half cleared. How the fuck are they? That would be nice to score. 20 minutes to go. Another one bites the dust. Oh, another shitty one. Another shitty one. Another shitty one bites the dust. Lots of time. But not when you're overs. Not when you're overs. Because we could probably concede another three in this time. I'm not right now. I have I have I have a lot of uh uh any of those? Any of fucking those, thank you, referee. But like I'm disappointed with Niall Ennis. Disappointed with Moran. Who else am I? I've got a grudge with. I've got a grudge with. Siggy. Siggy. I'm also a little bit pissed off with him at the moment. Dom Hyam. I, in fact, there's fucking not many. There's not many yet. But right now, I need somebody to, to put a smile back on my face. Free kick. Go on, Moran. Have a shot. Scoops high. Decent ball. Anyone on? Anybody want to go? Pickering. Wharton. Scoops. Have a shot, mate. Corner. Fuck no. Who is the defence? I don't need. Uh, whatever. I don't fucking know. Hull with possession right now. 
cruising to three points. Uh, how? Yeah. Dom Heim getting red card. Fuck me. Dom Heim. Dom Heim, mate. You let me down. Fucking let me down. Come on then, Rovers. Let's do let's do some master, some master class. Let's stop fanny around now, play, playing out the back. Let's stop fanny around. We can still snatch something here. We can still fucking snatch something. The off skis. You taking hound? Okay, I'll back you. Is that what you wanted? Uh, you can take me to the Okay, I'll back you and Shots here, hole. Clear, Rovers. Hey? What? Free kick, Rovers. It's Scott Twine, six fingered banjo playing weirdo. Uh, pardon me. Free kick here for Rovers. Way out wide. Wharton. Ben the Boss Jackson. As much as I agree with you that this result, four defeats in the spin, is sackable, Venkies do not do this. Do not fucking sack them. They should. Don't get me wrong. I'm saying they sh You know, it should be something... You know, and, and if we have any desire, if we have any fucking, you know, a, 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 I look like a handball. Um, you know, let, let's look, let's look what's, just give me a minute here. Just give me a minute while Niall Ennis, soldier is on. Thank you, Niall Ennis. Prove me wrong that you, there is a player in you. Fatigue's going to be a, a factor here, but Stevie Cooper is out there. And I, I, I think if we were to, you know, Stevie Cooper is 
he could he could he could do magic. His his stock has taken a bit of a tumble. I thought he was a little bit harsh to get fired by um also oh, chance here, Rovers. Somebody have a fucking go. Joins the chat, Heddingberg. Well, don't get me wrong. So, so look, let's let's turn the clock back. Derby two two against Oxford. By the way, they um they had Steve King misguided, didn't fucking want to sack him despite relegation, despite everything, despite everything. Uh, and then they wouldn't sack him, wouldn't sack him, wouldn't sack him, and then they went on a sacking rage. You know, they they they. In fact, first they fucking sack, sacked Sam Allardyce. Stupidly, brought in Paul Lintz. Garbage decision. No, is that right? No, no, no. I'm, I'm wrong. I got my, I'm getting a bit muddled up. Anyway, went sack Steve Keane, despite all the other shit going wrong with it, and then went on a sacking rage, and then stuck with Mowbray through the through some really shit bits of form that would have been uh, done. So he would have been fired many, many times over at other clubs. Anyway, Stevie Cooper is available. I think if you would offer me right now JDT to stay and Stevie or Stevie Cooper, I think I would go for Stevie Cooper. But, um, but are we realistically going to get Stevie Cooper, the uh, the most prettiest man in uh, in football? I don't think so. I think he may have still got uh, a stock level uh, that warrants a Premier League side. We are more likely to get a Nathan Jones kind of player. Not that there's anything wrong with that. They come Holt, Scott Twine, little fucking six finger banjo playing weirdo. Mark Hughes, you can shove that up your ass. What about? So, sackable form. Vankies will not sack him. Um, and I and I'm not I'm not I'm not saying he should be sacked, but it is sackable form. But he won't get sacked because Vankies don't do the sackings. And um, he's on a contract, and they are tight as fuck. The only way that JDT will leave is if JDT gets pulled out of his contract or his contract expires. That's the only way JDT leaves. Rovers are frugal. Ten minutes to go, guys. Ten minutes to go. Smash the likey likey, guys. If you can do what Teray says, appreciate it. We are, we are, we are seeing the year out. Seeing the year out with a loss. However, Smodic, top division, division, top goal scorer from midfield, Carter. We have to go for it. We're losing this game right now. Moran with a fucking another pointless back heel touch there. Who's going to come in when there's no money for players? I don't know. Nathan Jones did work uh, on shoestring for Luton. Did work on a shoestring. Football was not pretty, but the shithouse tactics got him to the playoffs. He walks in the summer. He's a wealthy man. JT would leave the second he got the opportunity. No, I don't miss Morton. You can shove him up your ass. Go on, Smodic. It's a dangerous ball in there by Smod. However, chance, Moran. Shoot! What a weak-ass, piss-ass shot that was, Adam Wharton. Do you not put your boots on this morning? With our money issues, they'll probably give us the job to Damian Johnson. But I, I, I don't... Middlesbrough 2 went up against Huddersfield there. Charlton leveled against Bristol Rovers. Uh, anything else going on? Rotherham 1, Sunderland 1, Watford 1, Stoke 1. But why on earth did um, did Adam Wharton, you know, pass that ball into the into the goalkeeper's belly? Why would Steve Ward take on this poison chalice? A club joined, losing one million a month and no money uh, coming from India. You're right. You're right. But but um, 
Stranger things have happened. Stranger things have happened. Niall Ennis with the greatest touches, the most elegant footballer ever. Dirk, question, what happens if we get if we get done at home against Rotherham? Why don't Dirk take the job? Because I'm 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 I would never I would never want to manage Rovers because I would make terrible, terrible decisions. It's kind of like Gareth Ainsworth doing the job or Matt Smith, the Doctor Who, doing the job. You know, you kind of, you, you pick over, like I'd, I'd, I'd get Bradley Dack back. I'd probably sign Morton Gamps Pedersen again, roll back the years, get Dick, Big Dick Smallwood to be our third goalkeeper. You know, I'd make stupid decisions Not giving a free kick on that one. Rovers push there. High uh, high press by Rovers. Come on then, you can get there to this, Rovers. Smodic. Come on. Fight. I'd make some real howlers. So, it's probably not a good idea. Why can't Vegas do a secret handshake with the Indian government? Why don't they? Why don't they, you know? And what's happened to them? What's happened to their... It's a decent ball in there. Wharton, Smodic, give it to them. Give it to them on the right-hand side. We could probably score here, boys. We could probably score if we make the right decision or we just give it to Golden Balls. Smodic, but he's in a little bit of trouble there. Callum, matey boy, Britain. Pulls it back, Smodic. So it's not, there's no real output at the moment for Rovers. We're just, we're just trying to make something happen. Who would you bomb out, Dirk? What does that mean, bomb out? Who would you bomb out? What does that mean? That team huge put together with something else. What do you mean, who would I bomb out? What does that mean? Just let me know what that means. I, I'm, I'm not up with the kids' lingo these days. I'm a little bit behind. Who would I bomb out? I don't know what that means. I've got a vacuum. I've got a vacuum in a minute. I've got to clean the house up. Uh, why are we so wank? Why are we so wank and who would you bomb out? Those are the two questions that are on my lips right now. Uh, bomb out means fire. Bomb out means fire. Get rid of, I assume. Who would I get rid of? Um, when are we going to get pen? Okay, from our squad. Okay, well, okay. Um, well, at the moment, I'm not a fan of Neil Niall Ennis. I don't think he's he's proven any anything. I would, I would. Okay, okay. Now, now I'm thinking. I've got me thinking. Got the got the, got the cogs turning here. It's gonna be a. Uh, it's gonna be one of those. It's gonna be a nasty, nasty one. I'd sell Adam Wharton, and probably Hayden Carter, two of our most sellable assets. Uh, I think we could probably get twenty-five million for the pair, and that might be a bit crazy, cuckoo land talk, but I would sell them just to get the money. Niall Ennis, not really biggest fan. He can go. Um, Morton should be off here. I would, yeah. Um. Barnsley are not winning 3 2. I would like to see who can bring Jane. Sell Dolan. Yep, you're right on that one. Sell Dolan. Sell Gallagher. You know, well, actually, right now, I don't know. Like, the thing is, if I can get replacements in, then sure. Gallagher, I would sell. I sell those four because if you're not if you if you're not committed to the fucking badge, then be done with you. Get rid, get rid, be done. You're back just like that. I am back just like that, James. But um, but the jinx continues. The fucking jinx continues. It's not me. It's not me. Uh, I'd sell those four. Probably generate about thirty mil, and then I'd. Give 50 million, million for running costs and use 50 million to bring in. I don't know who the heck I bring in. But I'll say, hey, Stevie Cooper. So you're going to come in. Here's 15 mil. What are you going to do? Here's Callum Britton, though. Callum Britton, you're on the, on the verge of being sold. That's fucking horrendous. 
That's fucking her horrendous cross. Rooney, it's nil nil draw against Bristol City, who are on a good bit of form. Rovers are being Rovers are being just ghastly. Well, I appreciate you all singing out the year with me. As Rovers fucking horrendous form continues. I don't I don't even know where to go with this. I don't even know where to go. Yeah. That'll piss me right off, Obi Juan, if he went to fucking Burnley. Uh, Birmingham. Derby have Derby 3 2 there. I don't know. Of course you were, James. He's a fucking mastermind. I think any championship club will... will I think Sunderland are pissing themselves or, or uh, you know, wishing they could go back in time because they, they would have taken him, especially a massive club like that. They would have, they would have uh, done wonders with him. I don't know what JDT will say. I'm sure it'll be beautiful. Now here's fucking Hull City going for the fourth. Oh, dear me. Coventry flying fucking high. We need a run like that right now. It's just so miserable right now. Red cards flying in. They've had one at Millwall, one at uh, Deepdale. We've had one at Vicarage Road. We've had one here. Uh, don't know, James. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Meanwhile, Coventry are about to concede. About to shit the bed here. There could be 2-2. Two -two. Swansea may have equalised against Coventry. Wow. Well, this is the point in the bag for Coventry. Rovers getting fuck all here today. Scott Twine, or whatever his name is. What the fuck are you doing? Well, thanks for the welcome back. I, I appreciate it. I, I actually enjoyed it, watching it from the comfort of my home. Bur Fern Birmingham City, Neil. Bristol City, Neil. Rotherham. Drawing with Sunderland. Come on. No, of course he fucking wasn't. My neck hurts. Anyway, I'm going to get fucking wasted tonight in the bath. So if I don't make it for Rotherham, that's because I probably had too many beers. Um, shit show. Shit show extraordinaire. Come on, Walsh, that. Don't fucking funny around. Where's the urgency? You know what I mean? We're losing. Where's the fucking urgency? Get Rovera, get fucking Walsh up there. If we can get a fucking point, 
I'll do the fucking the best dance you've ever seen. It's James Hill with the longest, the world's longest shittest throw coming in. The world's longest shittest throw. Yeah, straight to a whole guy. Where are we going? Where are we fucking going? Why are we taking so long? You've got a minute and fucking 30 seconds left and you're taking, you're fucking uh, taking forever. What the fuck is that for a pass? Oh, come on. Jacob Carter in the house. Um... I thought he did all right. You know what? It, 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 it's done better than Niall Ennis. I thought he thought he had a, a a couple of chances. So fucking fucking blocked. I tell you what, though. I tell you what. Some of these refereeing decisions are absolutely fucking mad. Middlesbrough nick it at the death against Huddersfield. They beat Huddersfield. Piece of piss. We can't fucking do jack shit. Well, David, it's been absolutely. Um, I was I was happy at halftime. I have no idea what I'd do. We are. Oh, what a well! This isn't a lucky shirt right now, so. There it is. Final whistle. Final fucking whistle. I'm not going to take the shirt off. I don't, don't want to give you any guilty pleasures, people. Anyway, another, another shitty defeat. Four defeats in a row. Sackable. It's a sackable form right now. Um, but will he get sacked? He won't get sacked. Do I, want him sack? I don't want him sacked. I want him backed. Back him, not sack him. Back him, not sack him. That's what I'm going to leave you with. Back the fucking JDT, not sack him. Let's not just buy a fucking cheap-ass defender. Give him some money. Get him a striker or two. Uh, and maybe some fucking uh, uh, reinforcements in midfield. Maybe even a new keeper. I don't even know. We need... Uh, look at that fucking slot in the uh, press box. No disrespect. Um, 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 in the, uh, there was something on my screen. There was a dirty slot on my screen. When I say slot, it was me. Uh, anyway, that's it. I'm out. Um, 